my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new. So this video is going to be a 15th birthday wish list video. Also, I really need to point out that I'm really sorry that I haven't uploaded in ages. I kind of like took a little break, but I'm back now. Um, so today's video is going to be a 15th birthday wish list because I turned 15 in like two weeks. I turned 15. Oh, I turned 15 two weeks tomorrow. My birthday is on the 1st of November, and I'm filming this on the 16th. I think so. I turned 15 two weeks tomorrow so I thought I'd do like a wish list video of like things which I want for my birthday obviously I don't want to sound like really like demanding and grateful I don't really know what the word for it is um like this is literally just a video to like give you guys ideas for what you want to ask for your birthday or if you know someone that's turning like 15 or 14 13 16 etc then I'll give you like ideas for what you want to buy them because I know like sometimes we can be hard to buy for so here I am also like I kind of look okay, but I kind of don't look okay. Like, my face looks so pale because I had, like, um, clown makeup on for dance. I had a dance audition, so I had, like, clown makeup on, like, about an hour ago and I just wiped it off. And now, like, my eyes are, like, red raw because I couldn't get it off properly. But it's, it's fine. I'll get it off properly later. But I'm going to get I'm gonna get on with the video because I'm just waffling so much right now. Also, I got my hair braided. I did, like, a vlog of it, so I'll, like, upload that soon, I hope. I think. Okay, so the first thing which I really want for my birthday, it also, can I just say, again, and I just need to say that I'm not expecting, like, these things, like, the things that I'm asking, that I'm talking about in this video, like, I'm not expecting to get them, I know a lot of them are, like, very expensive and a lot of them, like, I just wouldn't expect to ask my parents to have, so I'm just, literally, it's just, like, ideas for you guys. The first thing which is on my wish list are the Adidas Originals Oswego Oswego <laughs> Are the Adidas Originals as we Oswego Juniors? I said it, and they're the ones in pink because honestly, I love the pink ones. Like they're so pretty. Like I'm not a fan of the black ones because they look a bit, they look a bit plain basically. I've already got black trainers, but these pink ones, honestly, I just love them. They look so nice. So, like some black leggings and just like just throw them with a pair of an outfit, like a really plain outfit. Just throw them on with. Honestly, I think they look so nice. And these are from JD. Okay, so the next thing which I really want is one of these scarf things, and this one which I'm putting on screen right now is from Sheen, but I'll literally just like, like them from it. You can get them from like pretty much anywhere, but they're basically scarf, like the silk scarves, and they're so pretty, like, and you can like tie them in your hair, or you can have them, like, you can wear them as like a top, um, like where you tie them at the front, or you can tie it at the back. Love that, it's like a trend lately, I honestly love it, I really want it. I know they're kind of like summery, but I feel like you could wear them like with a jacket over the top for winter, because I know it's like winter, winter now, I hate dressing for winter, honestly. But they're so cute, and I love them so much, and especially this pattern, which, um, I found them on Sheen, um, but you can literally just get them from anywhere, I think you can get them from like Amazon and places as well, because I know Sheen has like really like long deliveries. And the next thing I want is from Sheen also, and it's basically one of them pleated tartan like tennis skirts. I love them so much. This trend, like, honestly, I love it so much. Like, I can just, like, see me wearing it with, like, a white, like, like a plain white top, like, turtleneck top. Oh, so cute. Like, I just I don't think it's so cute. I love them. And it's, like, a big thing lately, and, like, everyone's wearing them. So, um, I just want to hop on that trend, honestly. Then the next thing again is from Sheen, and it's basically this, like, really cute, like, workout set. It's, like, blue, and it's, like, tie-dye. I love tie-dye recently. And it's, like, a blue, like, with a, like, scrunch, like, the ruched up sides, so you can, like, ruch them up even more. Honestly, I love it so much. It's, like, £12 for the pair. Beautiful. And I feel like you can also go swimming in these. Like, oh, yeah, it's bikini. It said it's, like, a drawstring bikini swimsuit, but, like, I feel like you could wear it for, like, working out in. Then the next thing on my list is a Alexa Echo Dot. I have been wanting one of these Alexa Echo Dots for the longest time. Like, I know like, they're really old now and they've been out for, like, absolutely ages. But I just have I've never got around to getting myself one. I don't know why. I just, like, whenever I go shopping, I don't even think about getting one. Um, so, basically, the Echo Dots for generations. I don't really know what that means. I'm <laughs> smart speakers. Because I just think it looks so cute at the side of my bed. Like, especially, like, the charcoal grey ones. It just fit in perfectly. And I love the idea of talking to an Alexa. The next thing is, and I know this is like a really big thing right now, so if you haven't got them like me, then you'll probably really want them. And it's the LED lights. And I basically already have these, like, I don't know if you can see in the background of this video, like, it's hard to fuck for the camera to focus on them. But I really want the LED lights, but I have already got these ones in my room. So I feel like if I had the LED strip lights, which are like going all the way around my walls, then I feel like it would look a bit like too much. So I decided that I want the light bulb instead. Um, so like that's like another option if you have like the same issue as me. It's so, like when I'm color changing light bulbs So I just love the idea of having like different colors in your room. And I was like love it And you can like control them with like one of the control things. I have one right here for my lights which I have these ones 
so easy to lose can i just point out though um and you can get them like anywhere you can literally get them off like amazon or like, ebay or something next thing on my wish list is the apple watch this apple watch strap i really i've had this so this is my apple watch this is like what my apple watch looks like and it's just got the plain like basic strap which you already get given like with it and i never really thought of changing the strap until recently when i saw someone who had like a really pretty chain on it and honestly this strap is so boring so i thought i really want like a metal one so you can like dress it up a bit more like when you're wearing like more dressy clothes it looks less sporty and like more dressed up so i really want this rose gold chain one Um, i would prefer silver but my like watch is rose gold so i'm not gonna like rose gold metal wouldn't go with silver metal so i want the rose gold one and that is off amazon you can get like really cute ones from like anywhere the next thing which, I'm out, which is on my wish list is the Nike Air Force One LVHUs. I really don't have to read these names, but I'm really sorry. <laughs> um, they're on screen right now. Um, I just love them. I honestly, don't, I don't know. Like, I don't usually like these types of trainers, and I know I have already have like so many trainers, and I need to stop. But they're so cute. Um, and these are from JD as well. Okay, so the next thing which I really want is like one of these trends, which is like used to be a thing, but then it went out of style, and then like it's like back in a thing again. And it's the Juicy Couture tracksuits. I want like the tube top. So it's like the pink pink tube top. Or I like the black one to be honest as well. I think they look so cute. Um, so like the, just like the plain like tube tops. Which just has like Juicy on it. Stunning. Literally love them. And they're so hard to find though. But I found them on J JD sells them. Like the tube tops. And also Urban Outfitters sells them I think as well. And the next thing which I really want to go with it. Is the Juicy Couture jacket. It's like the jackets with... Like the juicy on the back oh, i love them so much they sell them on depop as well like a lot of people sell them on depop um or you can get them off urban outfitters i think but they are really hard to find i don't know why i literally searched for ages with ages when i first wanted them and i couldn't find them anywhere but i have like found like where like places to get them now the next thing which is on my wish list is this river island bag and i know it is so basic and literally every single girl at my high school has this bag but i really want it and this one's like a shiny material which is kind of like a bit different to like the basic one which everyone has um but i really like slouch bags ones like slouching your shoulder i probably wouldn't use it for school because my school bag currently i just bought a new school bag and it's already ripped like down the side <laughs> because um of the amount of books which i have to carry in my bag so honestly i probably wouldn't use it for school because it is like 40 pound so i wouldn't use that for school but i'd probably like use it for like when i'm going out places love the starch bags so it's just so cute and that's from river and that's with river island ones okay so next thing is on my wish list which is like kind of like the but it is the most expensive thing on my wish list um i'm definitely not asking for this but it's so expensive um, because it's literally so expensive, I don't even understand how it's, I don't understand why it's so expensive because it's literally just a laptop. <laughs> I want the um, MacBook Pro, no, I want the MacBook Air. Is it MacBook Pro? No, I want the MacBook Pro basically um, because you can edit your video. I need to stop touching my hair, I'm really sorry. I'm going to push it behind my back because and then hopefully stop touching it. Um, but I really want the MacBook Pro because. I like, really struggle to edit my videos on my phone or my iPad and transfer videos to them because. I obviously can't transfer things to my phone when I'm while I'm using my phone. So then I always forget to transfer the videos and I go to edit them and I have to it's honestly stressful. But the MacBooks also have like a higher level of like editing on iMovie, which is like the app which I use like to edit my videos and you can also get like Final Cut Pro on it as well. I probably would just use iMovie for now because that's just what I'm used to. But like in the future if I wanted to get Final Cut Pro then I could get it on a MacBook. And also I literally do like a lot of my schoolwork on my laptop. So, um, I just think a MacBook would be so useful. I, I just want them so much. Um, but they are so expensive. They're literally like a thousand pounds. They're over a thousand pounds each. So, I definitely won't be asking for that. But that's just like something in case you want to be very out there and ask your parents for it. Is the Chinese here? I'm a model of the Chinese. And I'm, I'm trying to figure out if it's here or not. Because if it is, and I'm ditching this video, I'm going to eat it. It's not here. I just got really bad cramping my foot. Oh, okay. And I actually forgot to mention this when I was on about Juicy Couture. I really want the Juicy Couture black joggers. All the pink ones with, like, Juicy on the bum. Oh, I literally... I love it so much. I don't know what's wrong with me. Like, this is, like... It's not even my style. It's really not. Like, it, like I'm, I'm changing my style so much. I change it every single day. But I just... Love. Oh, these are from JD as well. So, okay, so the next thing which is on my list is... 
is basically like a few things from Michael Kors. Um, so the first thing which is on my list from Michael Kors is the Michael Kors like wallet and it's like the, not wallet, card holder should I say? Um, so it's like the orange one, no, it's not orange, it's brown, but I keep screenshotting things so like I can remember to put it on screen, that's why I'm screenshotting. Um, but it's basically like the brown like Michael Kors like wallet thing, so cute, I love it, so, there's a car that I'm going up outside my house, it's really annoying though, so I'm really sorry if you can hear that. Um, but it's like a brown like Michael Kors wallet and it's got like a gold little plate on it, card holder and card holders are perfect for me because I always have to put my card in. Can I just say, mine, my phone case, I accidentally ripped my pop sticker off, I really need a new phone case. Um, but um, my phone, my card is always in the back of my phone case because I can never be able to carry like my uh, purse around with me. Then I end up pulling my phone case off and breaking it like I've done with this one, like it's all snapped there. Um, so I could really use like a card holder to be able to carry like my cards around with me because I don't use cash, like I don't use cash at all. Like I just use card, it's so much easier and I can't lose the money. Oh, I can't lose my card. That'd be dangerous. That's slightly worrying. <laughs> and the next thing is this Michael Kors like actual like zip purse, and I honestly just love this because of the colours of it. It's like red and it's like a red and like a dark brown, and I just love I love red. Like I love like red things, like especially when it's like mixed with brown. Honestly, I just think it's so cute, and I prefer like smaller purses because um. I currently have like IOs, I don't know why I say that because I literally have the biggest purse in the world um, but I actually do feel like smaller purses because they're just easier to carry and like I usually go out, when I go out places I usually like just take my phone in my purse and just carry them too rather than taking like a handbag to put it in so like a big purse is like quite hard to hold then like a really small purse is also like easy to lose it's so, like a medium sized purse, perfect! and then we have the Michael Kors jade extra small logo and leather crossbody bag because basically i really have been wanting this like crossbody bag for ages like I've, this has been like on my phone like screenshotted for so long um because i just love it <laughs> um it's got like a like the metal chain is like so cute and like i feel like you could like dress it up or dress it down like if you're like gonna whip out to the shop or something you could, like grab it and put your phone in your purse in it or if like you're gonna like go and like to like a nice meal or something i feel like it'd look really cute like dressed up um, and I've been wanting this, this bag for like the longest. It's £230. Which isn't that bad for a design bag to be quite honest with you. Like I was expecting it to be more to be totally honest. Another thing which has been on my wish list for the longest time is the Vivian Westwood earrings. And I know again this is like so basic and like everyone has these. But I just I'm just literally obsessed with them. Like earrings are my favourite thing. Like if you've got really pretty earrings I feel like it just sets off like your whole face. <laughs> so these are the Vivian Westwood earrings and then the mini Baz Relief earrings. I don't really want like really huge ones like which takes over my whole year. And they're £80. I've literally got so much on this on this list for like pretty little thing clothes but I feel like if I just go through my whole wish list of pretty little things it's going to be so boring. <laughs> so next thing is one thing which I've been wanting for like the longest time and I have literally had this screenshot, I, I screenshot things when I want to buy them <laughs> and this has been screenshotted on my phone for the longest time and it's the Playboy Miss X Misguided charcoal grey like oversized t-shirt and I know like the Playboy X Misguided like thing came out like ages ago. Um, but I never got around to buying one because I don't usually shop on Misguided. Like I don't, think, I've never bought anything from Misguided. I don't think so. It didn't really make sense for me to just like order that on its own, especially since like you've got to pay for shipping for like one thing, and it's literally like the tiniest shirt. It's gonna be like the tiniest shirt as well. Um, so I really want the oversized tie dye grey T-shirt. I love like all the colours, but especially the grey. I think it just looks so cute with like some shorts, and I'm really loving like the oversized T-shirt vibe at the moment. So, and that is. Oh, it's meant to be £20, but it's actually in the sale of £12 right now, so... The next thing is these pyjamas from Pretty Little Thing, and I'm obsessed with these. Like, I love pyjamas, like, on a whole. Like, I literally love pyjamas. Like, if you know me, then every time I go out shopping, I have to buy a new pair of pyjamas. Usually, I from Primark, because Primark pyjamas are just peng. But, basically, it's this, like, pyjama set from Pretty Little Thing. It's got, like, these flared, like, trousers, like, striped trousers, and, like, a white, like, plain top. Honestly, it reminds me of, like, gives me, like, really clueless vibes. I don't know why. But I love it so much. I love the 90s fashion. Um, I know they're only pyjamas, but... Um, so these pajamas and I love them honestly and they're like 18 pounds and um, they do them like light blue as well which is really cute um, I could, I'd probably like like them in like baby pink or the light blue they're so beautiful okay the next thing we show I have thought <laughs> I 
I can't speak today. I think it's because I haven't filmed like a video in absolutely ages, but I literally could not speak like on these videos. Um, so I really the next thing you should want on my list wish list is a ring light. Um, I basically think a ring light would help me so much with my videos, and like when I take pictures as well. Um, for my Instagram, which I don't really post that much, but you know, um, I would love ring light because I could, oh, honestly it's so hard to film on a night when like it's dark because my room lighting isn't the best like it's better now that I have white walls because it kind of reflects it a bit better but it's not like amazing quality like and especially since I have a camera as well like if I had a ring light it literally just looks so professional um so I really want a ring light um I don't really care I want one of them ones like stands up and it's like on tripod and things um rather than one of them like really small ones also, they're really good to do your makeup in because my desk is like over this side of my room and my, my window's here, so that the, the lighting for doing my makeup isn't the best. So, they're really good to like be able to do your makeup in. Um, you can get these ring lights from anywhere, you can get them like from Amazon or eBay, and I think there's like quite a few shops that do them like where you can buy them like in store. Um, so yeah. Okay, that's basically the end of this video. I have got like a lot more things on my wish list, but I could go on for absolutely ages, and this video has already been cut off once because I've like exceeded like it's. Though exceeded the time on camera, so I'm going to finish it here. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to press the like, subscribe, and comment button, and press the post notification button so I'm notified every time I learn. Thank you for watching. Bye!